may be prowling monsters about. All right, let's try this again and try not to yeet ourselves off the edge of a cliff. Yes, you must travel at night, seek safety in numbers. I'm not jumping on that thing. You jump on that thing. Now, can I aim this? Sort of. Amiga Star says, 2023 was such a good year for games. 2024 will have a hard time to top that. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I, uh, I'm i really, really, really excited for Star Wars Outlaws. Um, was a close rate, that. Let us return to the encampment. There's a bunch of stuff I'm excited for. Glorfriend says, I'm not a Souls-type player at all. I've avoided this game because of that, but your experience so far is putting the fear to the rest of it. Um, I hate Souls games. I won't play Souls games. I didn't play Elder, Elden Ring because of that. But from what I've seen so far, this is not like a Dark Souls experience. Um, because it's not... Um, I, I haven't seen, and I could be wrong because I haven't gotten very deep into the game, but I haven't seen this being a game where you have to worry about um, like the bosses having... I mean, there are stages, but I don't think it's nearly as unforgiving as uh, Dark Souls and... Um, um, Elden Ring. I flat out wouldn't play any of those games. I have no desire to, like, die over and over and over to boss mobs. It's not fun to me. Alright. Well, I'm assuming the moon... The moon glow can only be found at night, probably. I'm gonna go gather some stuff first. Oh, a bunch of empty flasks. That'll be nice. There may be materials here. Perhaps we'll find aught of use. Materials where, brah? Mountain Ape says, once you load a spell, you can left, you can click on left stick to manual aim or click and right stick to lock on. If you don't do either, the game gives you a soft lock. All right, I'll have to play around with those as I get deeper into things. Yeah, I don't like hard games. No, that's correct, Amiga Star. I want story. Um, so I'm playing this on easy mode. Just to, we're gonna we're gonna see what we see. What's 
these? Kindling. Let's have a look at that rise in the land. There may be ought to harvest. The rise on the land. Is he talking about up top? Maybe? Oh, I guess you need the kindling. I see. We're picking stuff up. Well, I haven't seen any of that moon glow. They do? Show me the sea monsters. Where are these sea monsters? I don't see any sea monsters. What is that? Is that like something you can harvest? Yeah. You need a pickaxe. So apparently I have to go find a pickaxe somewhere. Alright, well, I don't see any said sea monsters, sir. You said that a minute ago. I haven't seen him yet, so they must be up top here somewhere. What monsters are we looking at? Those are bunny rabbits. Yeah, but we don't have a pickaxe. So I'm assuming I'm going to have to need to buy one back in the village. I'm also assuming I can't find that that moon glow stuff unless it's nighttime. Because I did find it earlier, or at least my pawn was harvesting it along the way. But then because I didn't save, I lost progress on that quest. So I think I'm going to have to go convert it to nighttime again. Before we do, though, I remember there's like an oil f barrel up here. We can go fill our flasks. Goblin! Oh shit, there's more goblins. I could have sworn somewhere around here there was a. Um, there it is, right there. Who knows what lies in wait? Best proceed with caution. Sea monsters are further out to sea. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to go turn it back to nighttime so we can see about getting those um, Plants of flowers. Grow at the tree's feet, like so many verdant children. 
Your hometown, is it not? We'll have need of a lantern if we hope to search by night. Gives me chills just to think of it. Ah! Uh, I was. Uh, I'll make no excuse, cousin. I hid in the well for fear of the dragon. And let me tell you this you'd be wise to keep your distance from that pit. I was too craven to venture far. And lucky thing, a queer growl echoed back with the sound of water from further in. There's aught down there. Mark my words. I could feel it, I could. You not see me going back down there to find out what. Well, guess what we're about to do. What? You mean to go down there? You're a right hero. Yes, I am. That's why I get paid the beep big bucks and you're just a lonely town guard. Here, if you're set on going, take this with you. It should have some use to it left. I'll not soon forget your bravery, cousin. Pray, just come back alive. He gave me another lantern? This will be a manually... This will be a manual save right here. I like how the pawns go ahead and do things like blow blow up barrels and stuff. Which way should we go, Arisen? I don't know which way we should go. Rats! What's this? If you lose your way, you need but consult your map. Oh, bats! Motherfucking bats in a cave! Why'd you jump down, brah? Bats! So, I'll have to figure out how to do the, um, how to put that on a person. Coin pouch, almost fell. Don't fall.
So one thing I'm learning is that you have to slow down in this game because uh, everything is much slower than uh, things I've played recently. Like it takes time to cast the spells. I'm beginning to understand now why when I was watching the Dragon's Dogma 2 gameplay reveal, I was making comments on that reaction video about why is everyone, why are they running around so much in combat? Why are they not just, you know, attacking the mob and everything else? And I'm realizing because everything is slower here, part of it is moving around constantly for positioning and stuff. So there's a learning curve here for sure. Oh, I just checked a rat corpse. That was freaking amazing. I like chucked it. Yeet! Was the victim of a monster, most like. Lucky is the pawn able to fight at the arisen side. I am thankful. Oh, I heard something. I hear something. Here's some sort of creepy crawly back in here. I hear something growling down in there. Like something breathing. This is not going to be good. I'm going to manually save here. <gasps> I can't save here. Why not? Can I not save in caves? I'm betting we can't save in caves. All right, nothing for it. Look, there are people we ought to be able to return this way. Okay, well, returning is fine. Let me get out of the way first. Oh, and they don't they don't uh, they don't get knocked back. Run away. Oh shit, is there another one? There's definitely three. Oh my god, we are so screwed. Oh yeah, he's down. He's down. Ah. That cave is probably too difficult, I'm assuming. Oh, that's how this works. You return to the last autosave. How do I... If I hit retry, does it just put me right here at the same place? It put me somewhere in the cave. I feel like I'm not ready to jump off that... Uh, precipice yet it's been dead for some time. This looks interesting. It's a troubling foe. It's a rat, dude. Wouldn't call that troubling. I wonder if there's any way to to like attack them from up atop.
He just ju did he just jump down? What are you eating for, bro? Welcome to the channel, Ellie. I do not get the finer points of aiming as was described in the chat a few minutes ago because uh, I don't seem to be able to manually aim at all. I cannot take much more. Oh, he did not mean to pull that one. Yeah, I'll get you in a minute, bro. So like it only wants to auto target his tail. And I don't seem to be able to position it in any other way. Did that not work? I definitely didn't heal him. I cannot move. Like I want to target something other than its head or than its tail, I wish you'd say. I just knocked its tail off. My consciousness fades. Did he just run away? Keep the lantern dry. Vocation rank increased. Don't know what that means. I still hear, hear creepy crawlies. I bet I can't save yet. Nope. Man, I need to get a pickaxe. I'm going to waste good mine, good ore down in here. It said something about don't get your lantern wet. Emperor's pillar. Uh oh, something's attacking us. Run away! Run away! What is it? Where is it? I cannot take much more.
You know what I bet I was supposed to do is go, go, run away. I bet I was supposed to go talk to the stone before I did this to get more companions or something. Ouch. I definitely hear another creepy crawly. Oh, there he is. Ouch. No, I'm not all right. Oh, there's two of them. We are so screwed. No, run away, run away, run away, run away. So I must be wet or something. That's must be what that effect is. Oh, he made it up here with me. No, 